If you're using a percentage-based gradebook in Angel, for example, tests are worth 30%, you'll need to update your gradebook after the conversion to Desire to Learn. By default, your gradebook will be displayed as points-based gradebook. So I'm in a course. I'm going to go in my Angel, the Angel course for this course that was migrated to Desire to Learn. I'm going to go to Management, and I'm going to go to Gradebook, and I'm going to go to Categories. And you'll notice that the weights are based on percentages, so it adds up to 100%. It's not based on the points for that particular category. It's based on the weight. So what happens when it comes into Desire to Learn? Desire to Learn will make that gradebook points. So we need to change it back to percentage. So I'm going to go over to Desire to Learn. Once I come into the course, I'm going to go ahead into the grades. And what you're going to see here are the categories. So all the grades come. There's quizzes. There's tests. They come across. Um, if I click on the actions for this category, this grade item, it's really a category, and I scroll down, you'll notice that it says it's 20 points per item. And that's because it took the weight of 20 and wants to take that 20 points and distribute it. So if you don't change this, it will then mess up your grades completely. So the way you change this is pretty simple, actually. Um, you don't have to go into each one individually. You actually go to the setup wizard. When you go to the setup wizard, you're going to see that, that it will tell you right there that the grading system is points. All I need to do is click start, change the points to weighted, click continue, and just keep the adjusted final grade. Keep continuing, unless you're not dropping anything, automatically keep the final grade updated. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and use the percentage scheme. This is where you can make a choice. It's going to display two decimal places if you don't want. You can say 0 or 1 or whatever you want, or you want to keep it 2, that's fine. I continue. It's going to, what it's going to display for the students is the weighted grade. Um, and again, decimal points displayed is going to be 0. And I'm going to go ahead and... Um, and I'm going to make sure that this is checked. Display the final grade calculation. Display final grade calculation to users so students can see it. I'm going to click Continue. It's going to tell me now what's going on, and I click Finish. And what that will do, it takes you back to these gradebook items now. And all I need to do is if I go back into Manage Grades, and again, now I click on this gradebook item and click Edit Gradebook Item, notice that it has a weight, and it's 20% for the course. So that's how you have to change it. Again, pretty simple process, but um, that's it.